hello, good morning, welcome to a new vlog. So this morning I tried to get tickets for Sky. Fail, super fail. I couldn't get tickets for Korea and I tried also for Chicago. No, so like, I'm not gonna see him and that's okay because I'm gonna try harder to get tickets for ATs because that's all I can do. I can, this is my, my feeling right now, just hands up. I don't know, okay, anyway. I have a really busy week. I leave for Korea on Friday as, if you watch my vlogs you already know because I keep talking about it and I don't shut up. Anyway, I leave for Korea on Friday and I have to start getting my house prepared and also get packed. So right now I'm about to study. After I study, I'm going to be cleaning up my house because it's kind of messy and starting to pack. I also need to contact my pet sitter so that way she can come and see my house and stuff because I moved from last time and then talk to her about like what needs to be done and go from there. So it's a really busy week for me and I'm very excited. I'm going to study and then be cleaning because your girl's got to be productive this week. If I'm not productive, what are we doing? Okay, I just finished studying. It's about 2 p.m. right now, so it's a little bit later than I normally would like to finish, but whatever. I'm gonna make a quick lunch right now, just a pasta dish. Uh, I'll actually show this time because I always forget to show it. I'm gonna have my lunch and then I'm gonna be doing a bunch of housework for probably a couple of hours because I need to pick up, I need to wash the cat pan because I like washing it like every few weeks just so it's fresh. And I'm gonna switch them out actually, just so that way when the pet sitter gets here, everything's fresh. I have to clean their water fountain, do the dishes. I have a lot to do, so I'm gonna do that, okay? I'm gonna make lunch first. Okay, so my pasta has chickpea pasta. I think I did about 53 grams. I did mozzarella cheese, Parmesan cheese, Alfredo sauce, but I mixed it with cottage cheese. So that way it's higher protein, lower calorie. I did steamed vegetables or I always microwave my vegetables like I do for dinner. Just broccoli, carrots, cauliflower, and corn. And then I used the little packages of chicken that I get from Costco. And this is my lunch. I believe it's around 631 calories for this whole bowl. And I'm gonna eat this and then I'm gonna be doing my housework and I'm also having it with an orange LaCroix. I like orange or tangerine like sparkling water but yeah. Good morning guys, so I have so much to do today as well. The pet sitter is coming over today around 11 for me to show her where I live and stuff, so I have to do that. But I have to get the house ready before because I still need to like pick up some stuff. So I'm gonna do a really quick workout this morning. It seems like that's the running theme this week is that I need to do short workouts because I just don't have time. I'm probably gonna do like a 20 minute workout this morning and then shower quickly. And then I have to clean up a bunch of stuff so that way when she's here, everything's organized. So that way she doesn't have to like wonder I guess like I don't know I just wanted to be clean for when she comes here I also got my pre-sale code for ATs which makes me really happy so I don't have to worry about that well I mean I have to still get tickets but at least I don't have to worry about the pre-sale code so I'm gonna work out now
right, so I just met with the pet sitter. She just left, and right now I'm gonna be making a spreadsheet for her just to show like everything we talked about, just so that way she knows. It's on the app too, but I felt like just writing down more details on a piece of paper and printing it out for her would be great too. So I'm gonna be doing that, and then after that, I'm gonna be studying. It's already about noon, so I'm not behind schedule. I'm always saying that, but like I have all the time in the world, right? So I'm gonna be studying for about an hour to an hour and a half, and then I'm gonna probably be doing some stuff around the house. I need to clean up some stuff. I need to fold the laundry. I need to just start getting stuff organized for leaving. Busy, busy, busy. So I finished studying. It's around 2.30 and I'm just having my lunch. I'm having pasta again. After I study, I'm going to be folding laundry and just organizing some stuff to get it ready for when we leave. I'm going to organize all the cat stuff as much as I can. I want to put it on the kitchen table so that way everything's easy for the pet sitter to access and she doesn't have to like look for anything. So I have a little bit of a headache. I think I'm tired. I'm going to like take the rest of the day a little easy. We're going to see how I feel after I eat lunch. I've already walked like 12,500 steps which is technically my goal on my Samsung app or whatever on my like tracking app but I usually try to hit around 20,000 so we will see we'll see how I'm feeling if I feel better after I eat and stuff I'll walk more but if I'm really feeling just kind of drained I'm gonna take a break So I'm eating breakfast now, I just made it, and the AT's tickets go on sale very soon, and I'm like low-key stressed about it, but like, we're gonna try, okay, we're gonna try, because I didn't succeed for IM, so it's like, hopefully we're good with AT's. Did I say AT's or TXT? I meant AT's, so if I said TXT, my bad. So there's less than two minutes left for the queue. I'm trying to get tickets for both LA and Oakland, but we'll see. I'm stressing, I'm not recording it though, so wish me luck. So for LA, I have a number, but for Oakland, I done. Oakland is about a fifth of the way through the queue and then for LA I don't know. I'm not worried about getting tickets in LA I'm more worried about Oakland because LA is huge and I'm just trying to get tickets just like in general. But for Oakland girl, I don't know. Fingers crossed. Okay everything is done. Oh my god. That was rough. Okay. But I got tickets for both. For Oakland I got super super lucky. I did not get floor because I don't like standing. I'm not gonna do that. Even though floor is VIP. I did get row too however so i'm like really really close and then for la i just got like i'm in the 100s but i got like tickets that are like facing the stage so like i'll be able to like see the whole show which is really nice and those ones are really cheap the ones i bought in oakland were expensive honestly they were similar in price to what i spent for txt whatever you know just it's fine it's not a big deal but this is the first pre-sale for et so i'm gonna be checking the price for everything as the next couple of days progress i'm so happy that i got lucky enough to get tickets because ats was my big thing this year i did see that mingyu was teasing 17 going on tour again i don't actually know if that will come into fruition if they do i assume that i'll be on the east coast at the time because it's already gonna be may just kidding it's already may happy may 1st fucking dumbass i think if they're gonna tour it's gonna be probably like september october if they even did tour i don't know if they're even gonna come to like the states or anything it could just be another tour in asia so which is fine whatever they can do what they want they don't need to cater to me but i'm very happy i'm excited my goodness i feel like ats is gonna sell out I would honestly be shocked if they didn't. I mean, this is the pre-presale. This isn't like TXT where when I came back, there was tons and tons of tickets and nothing sold. Like this is the pre-presale and there's still another pre-sale tomorrow. And then there's another sale. So like this is the first pre-sale. The second one is May 2nd. And then the third one is Friday. I'm going to study now. And then Alex actually has to go to the vet soon. I forgot. God, I'm gonna do that. Bye. I'm just gonna give Alex his medicine now. It's gabapentin, so hopefully he's like chill when he goes to the vet. Come on, let's go. Let's go to the vet. You're goofy. Alex. Okay, hello. I got back from the dermatologist a little while ago. Alex is doing pretty good. They still want to continue with the eardrops with him because he still has some buildup. So the pet sitter is going to have to give him some eardrops, which is fine. No infections or anything, which is really great. But I did clean out his ears because of the gabapentin. He's kind of like sedated a little bit still. So I was able to clean out his ears. So he's all set for now. And then I'm going to keep giving him the eardrops and stuff until I leave. And then pet sitter will take over. I'm just editing right now. 
trying to finish a vlog. I have to start packing tonight for Korea so that way my stuff's organized before I go because I haven't actually started packing yet and I need to organize my house a bit. I need to go through my refrigerator and get rid of any old food as well as clean my house. So I think today and tomorrow I'm not studying and probably the next day I have other stuff I need to get done. I'm a little stressed but after meeting with the pet sitter and stuff I feel a bit better because I just feel like they will be taken care of, everything will be handled for them. But I just want to organize and get everything set for them and for her so when she comes it's a lot easier. And of course like I said cleaning up my house, getting rid of like all old food, all old fruit, anything like that and then you guys will see anyway. I need to just shut up okay. I'm gonna edit for now. So I just made some chicken tenders, well they're like chicken bites, whatever, for dinner. This is Greek yogurt mixed with Chick-fil-A sauce. I honestly prefer it. It's like a really thick sauce and it tastes really good. More calories, more protein, whatever. I'm thinking about changing my channel name and I'm pretty sure by the time I post this vlog it'll already be done. But I want to change it to like my actual name. I love the punny punny but that name doesn't really fit. That's the name my husband will call me because my real name is Tiffany and my husband, since he's Korean, it's pronounced Tipani. So he says punny. He doesn't call me Tiffany. That's why my name is Penny Penny, but I feel like I just want to change it to my actual name, which is Tiffany, because I mean, I like my name, why not? But I think I'm gonna change it to Tiffany so that way it feels a bit more like me. It's something I thought about for a while, so I think it's finally time to just pull the trigger and change my name. So, hello, my name is Tiffany. Okay, so we are gonna go to Costco right now because his parents want us to get them some supplements, I guess. So, we're gonna go there and then I have to go to Target and get a couple things before I leave because I need shaving cream because I can only use one kind that doesn't like irritate my skin because your girl gotta be sensitive because why can't she just do anything normal? I don't know, whatever. And I'm gonna buy a pillow because I'm very picky about pillows. <laughs> so I need to buy a smaller one because I have a king size one. I want to get a queen size for when we travel. <laughs> Are they this expensive? $40? I need aquifer, I'm gonna die. Don't mind me, I look like a mess. I'm gonna do my skincare and teeth cleaning because I guess I am in fact an orthodontist or a dentist or whatever if I can clean teeth. I'm gonna start packing in a little bit. I got some travel stuff, but I need to find my backpack. I literally don't know where it is. I have like my pink backpack and I haven't been able to find it in like two weeks. I don't know where it went because that's my backpack that I like have all my stuff. I have a Nike backpack. It's smaller and it doesn't hold a lot. So I need my bigger backpack for when I'm on the plane. So I'm gonna be looking for it. I really don't know why I have these breakouts here at all because like I don't normally get breakouts but I feel like it's like hormonal or something because I never get these like this one it always comes back like on my chin but these ones are so new I've never had them before and it's super weird like girl she's basically empty it's kind of funny to me how much better my skin looks, but yeah, at the same time, how bad it looks. Like, I don't have perfect skin by literally any means, but oh my god, it was so bad when I was young, but it's like, this is literally like night and day. But at the same time, I'm like, man, there's still stuff I wish was better, but whatever. So I haven't done anything. I can't find my backpack still, but I think I'm just gonna go to bed soon and get up early to finish packing and like get everything together because I'm pretty tired and I just don't think I'm gonna be productive. I 
morning. Good morning. I have a billion things I have to do today. At this time tomorrow, I'll be at the airport. And I haven't even bothered to work out this morning. I just genuinely have so much I need to do. I need to get my house set and pack everything. And we're also getting a rental car tonight. So that way we can take a one-way rental to SFO. So that way we don't have to get like an Uber and stuff because we have six bags. But I'm gonna feed them and then I'm gonna shower first because I need to wash my hair. The first thing is just feeding these little bugs. Here you go, Minnie. All right, come on, sir. Let's go. There you go. There you go. Oh, you can eat. It's fine. Eat. Today is a contacts kind of day because I need to be able to see. I mean, I usually prefer my glasses, but I wore contacts again when I was in LA and I actually liked them. So I was like, okay. Sunscreen because your girl gonna burn. I burn inside with the windows closed. Sunscreen on, contacts in, hair wash, time for breakfast. Alex, that's my seat. to eat. My earrings are done. They're all clean, which is great. And now Minnie wants to eat more food. So I'm gonna feed her and then I need to fold the laundry, I think. Or do the dishes. I don't know, I just have to do everything, so. Right now I'm working on cleaning up my office. It's pretty messy to be honest, but I'm gonna pack some of my makeup and what else? My makeup and then my nail stuff because I'm gonna bring the stuff that I normally do to do my nails with so that way I can do them like there. And then I'm just gonna like dust and organize really quick because I'm literally deep cleaning my whole house before I leave. So when I come back, it's nice and clean. But okay, I'm stupid and I put February as April, but now it's May. So we're gonna change this. So someone got like no screen time, sorry. So May is now San and Yunho, but oh, um, excuse me, sir, get it, get it together. Jeez, are you drunk? So, May is now Yuno and Sun, and for May, it's Hoshi. For my last calendar, it's every member of 17, but I'm not gonna be here anyway, so whatever. So I bring my nail file, nail clippers. I use this stuff every single day. Not every day. It says you're supposed to use it, like, every day, but I actually find that putting it on, like, once or twice a week is better. My buffer, more makeup. Of course, I will bring this. I think I have my bigger one in my other backpack. I'm gonna clean that out later. I'm gonna bring two things of wax just in case. And then all my contacts are gonna come with me. I don't normally wear them, but it's fine. This is just going on my very, very messy table right now because my goodness. I'm gonna put these on my backpack. I actually had to order a new one though. I know what you're thinking. Tiffany, why is this side of your face or hair wet? Okay, listen, don't worry about it. So I'm gonna set a timer right now for 30 minutes so that way I can clean my office. I have 30 minutes to do everything I need to do in here because I'm kind of running out of, not running out of time. I have until seven tonight to get everything together. So I have about seven hours, which seems like a lot. I'm gonna start. This is all going with me, so I have to pack all of this. I had a new one of these and I didn't even know, so I'm gonna change up my band. My desk is so messy. I need to just like put these somewhere. These are also coming with me. I need to take these. Or I could just rip it open, not a big deal. Ooh, it's brand new, oh my gosh. Oh, just kidding, I did it backwards, my bad. I like this one. This looks very nice. Okay, I think my desk looks pretty good for now. It definitely looks a lot better than it did, so. These are basically empty, but I keep them, so. 
Okay, so we have about 13 minutes left. You know, I just had to vacuum, so we're ahead of schedule. I have a tea stain on my floor and I need to clean it. I forgot about it. Um, hello? Okay, it looks much better. Okay, I finished my office with three minutes to spare. Now I'm gonna do the hall bathroom. I'm probably only gonna give myself like 10 minutes because I cleaned it like two days ago, so. Okay. Ta-da! Three minutes to spare again. Now I need to throw all of this away. So I'm having lunch now. I'm just having my pasta dish. I was on the phone with my mom. So I was talking to her for a little bit. I got the kitchen done as you guys saw. I cleaned out my fridge. Some of that chicken was like not good, okay? After I have my lunch, I'm gonna move on to the bedroom and I'm gonna organize and clean that. And then I need to fold my laundry and stuff. My robot was running right now, which is awesome. So my living room will be nice and clean. The mop is washed and they are resuming cleaning, but we're making progress. It's two right now. So I have about probably four more hours for me to pack, organize the rest of the stuff and go from there. I'm literally so dumb. I ate my entire dish of pasta and I made like some chicken tenders to put on top of it because I like adding extra protein and I never put them on and I just ate the last bite and I'm like, wait, I'm so fucking dumb. I swear to God. Nini's gonna hate me. I have to vacuum in here. Sorry, sweet girl. So my first suitcase is packed, which is all my clothes, but I still need to pack my like bedding and my pillow. I'm just bringing like a cooling blanket because I get really hot when I sleep. So after I get my pillow and my blankets in my other suitcase, I'm going to start packing my skincare and get that all ready for when I leave. So I'll have everything in there and then tomorrow I'll just use what I need and put it back and go from there. If you can't tell, I'm kind of running out of steam. I've been at this since 7.30 this morning and it's currently, I believe... It's just about five o'clock, so it's been a long day. <laughs> I have about two more hours to be able to get everything done before we have to go get the rental car. Chipotle for dinner because we have no time. I think he likes my new backpack. Alex, you weirdo. It is 10-ish right now and I'm getting ready for bed. I said I'm getting ready for bed. I didn't say I'm going to bed. I said I'm getting ready for bed. I am still packing I need to do. Not a lot to be honest. I still need to pack my backpack and my carry-on. I got pretty much everything else I think. And then I still need to put the cat stuff all together. I have a lot to do. I'm excited but I just want to sleep before I get on the plane because I want to stay awake the whole plane ride. So that way when I get to Korea, I think by the time I get there it'll be like 10 p.m. my time. So I think that'll be good. 
good because I can kind of stay awake and kind of try to avoid the jet lag, so. I know I'm gonna be tired, of course I'm gonna be, because I have to get up at like 6 a.m. I might have to get up earlier, actually, I don't know. I don't really know what our game plan is tomorrow, I just know we have to get to the airport and I have to get on a plane, so. I already downloaded stuff to watch. I might download some more before I go to bed. Don't mind me, okay? I'm trying to floss my teeth, I'm being responsible. Don't judge me. Okay, well the light judged me. I don't know, I don't really know what I'm doing in Korea. I don't really care where I go, honestly. People are like, what do you wanna visit? It's like, I don't know. I don't care. I don't have anywhere that I specifically want to go, honestly. Like, there's no cafes, nothing. I don't have any plans, but I'm gonna finish getting ready for the night. I don't know if I'm gonna record more. If not, good night. But if I do, not good night.